What's up you guys, Zeddy at Fliptronics. I'm gonna be showing you how to trade on the Binance app. Okay, Binance has become the number one crypto exchange in the world. I've traded thousands of dollars on here, profited quite a bit. I'm gonna be showing you my strategy for how I've been using it, and I will have a link in the description if you wanna sign up and check them out. Okay, so the way I've been you know, using Binance, I started off with Coinbase you know, a couple of years ago, and Coinbase is awesome, don't get me wrong, but the problem with them is that you know, you really can't trade a lot of crypto on here. They've got just the major ones like Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, Ethereum, Ethereum Classic, Litecoin. They're going to be adding more coins in the future, but you are going to need some kind of wallet uh, like Coinbase that you can, you know, transfer money into Binance with. So I always like to show my account history on here, but, you know, I've traded quite a bit. You know, you can see some of my, uh, you know, sales on here of like 1100 2900 500 400 2000 you get the idea here you know i've been very actively uh you know trading different crypto for a while now but anyways whatever wallet you're using you're going to need one to you know fund your binance account okay so anyways i'm going to load binance up real quick and the reason that i think that you know they've become so popular so fast is because they've got one of the greatest apps for actually making trades um you know there's a lot of things that i like about using this it almost feels a little bit comparable to uh, you know Robinhood for stock trading, but definitely more analytical, and they do give you more options on here to you know check things out. So, anyways, um, this is how the platform looks on your phone, and you know if you want to sort by different things, you can sort by 24-hour price changes, which you know just lets you know you know what's been going up and what's been going down <clears throat> for the last 24 hours which is cool you can check the last price on here and then you can sort by name and volume which is really cool too now this is important because when you're searching by volume you get an idea of what's really you know being bought and sold a lot so i mean you can kind of see that which is powerful stuff if you're in the you know trading <clears throat> okay anyways um there's been a couple different cryptos i've been looking at personally i think neo might be one uh you know worth looking at for me personally to put a lot of money into and I, I haven't done it yet it's been between this one and iota um that i've been thinking about really buying but <clears throat> anyways this is a chinese crypto right here it's selling for around 15 dollars um as soon as you click on any of these cryptos you will see these you know line graphs this is buying and selling you've got candlestick charts which basically show you you know reds the selling greens the buying um you can sort this out differently too you can uh, pull up different charts here you can check the one week the one day 12 minutes five minutes 30 minutes the one hour and it'll show you like what's actively going on you know with this particular coin so whenever you're ready to buy you know any of these you just click the buy option right here type in the amount of usd you want and uh you know you'll be good to go so anyways like let's say you wanted to you know buy um I don't even know how much here. We'll just throw on a, a crazy number, just a ton of this. You would click buy and then you would be able to own, you know, this particular coin. Now, the other thing is that um, selling is just as easy on here. You know what I'm saying? So if you buy, you know, any of these coins and you want to hold them for like even five minutes, you could buy it, sell it really quick, or you could hold it for a while. My strategy is always to kind of like buy and hold. You know, I'm not actively like trading stuff off and on you know but like i will if i buy something i'm going to hold it for you know at least a week a month maybe even longer than that depending on where i think it could go and if it's moving up so anyways this is basically the binance app it's just very user friendly i just think that's why it's become you know so popular so fast and it's literally become the number one exchange for trading crypto in the world um you know you will obviously like i said you know, need some kind of wallet to fund money into Binance. Um, Coinbase has just been the one that I've been using, you know, for the last couple of years. So that's why I'm showing it to you. But anyways, uh, the app looks exactly the same on both iOS and Android. So you're not going to see anything different. Um, if you have any questions or comments about, you know, trading on Binance, obviously you can hit me up below, but it's really easy. You don't need to complicate it at all. Um, if you're in a stock trading or have any experience with that, it's it's a lot similar to how you're buying and selling. I mean, you know, especially with some of those graphs, you can see like the volume, prices, you know, what's going on, all that kind of stuff. So I will have a link in the description if you want to create an account at Binance, you know, get started trading some crypto. They have over 100 different coins you can trade on there. They've got the top ones and 
you know, they're going to be adding more and more, you know, as time goes by as well. And they're going to have more updates to this app, too, in the future that are just going to be awesome. Uh, if you guys could also hit the like and share button on this video, I'd appreciate it. Thanks for watching it, and we'll see you all later.